first time I'm opening up this beehive I feel like they probably already split because it's first day of April oh look at this ants everywhere they don't hurt the bees it's just kind of nonsense to the beehive oh look at that that beehive is so full look at that this is so packed this is most likely all honey that's crazy I don't even have to feed these bees at all okay let's open it up another one because it's probably all honey yeah it feels like honey so heavy oh. for sure it's all honey oh wow look at that by the way this is a Friedman free beehive and this is right here pieces of the one guess what I'm seeing no mites in those dome. that's amazing look at that they're filling it up all with honey and pollen that's amazing I set it to the side for now wow the other frame is just full of full with brood really good is there any eggs these bees look super healthy I do not see fresh eggs in there so if you see fresh eggs meaning like the queen is there but this is a beautiful full uh, frame of brood right here yep right here is the fresh eggs looking for the queen real quick none look at the pollen around there beautiful before they split I gotta give them another box no queen cells but wow look at that brood board that's insane wow they definitely need space so I'm gonna give them a bunch of empty frames over here one two three four five six frames that will keep them busy drawing out the comb and everything and in the future I might even split this beehive so looks like we have only one stone beehive out of about 10 or 12 beehives that I had all these are dead I just installed this one and I'll just clear them out maybe harvest the honey some of that look at those bees eating it up they spill honey and uh, yeah clean them up and install more beehives this year I'm gonna be trying to make videos at least every week or every other week come out here and make some videos and take care of bees since we have quarantine I have a lot of free time this beehive over winter really really good check this out so I'm gonna open them out open it up check the brood and everything by the way this beehive is treatment free had no treatments on it last year we'll see how it will do next year do I see any brood? no but I do see a lot of honey right here I see some dawn looks like they making queen cubs looks like they just hatched out I wonder if those dawns are like emergency queens yeah they're filling it up with the syrup there's a cup of honey on this side I don't know if it's new or from last year I'm gonna try to split them as much as possible so that way I'm going to have somewhat sustainable beekeeping so I don't have to buy new bees every time look how much honey left over because that's a lot of honey here look at that that's a fresh honey probably from last year and there's one more frame I'm not gonna mess with it oh uh, put everything how it was it's awesome and this boat wow there's a lot more bees on this one yeah looks like this is a frame of bees as well I'll put it all back this frame is full of honey and they're filling up this as well with honey so what I'm going to do is definitely fill up this thing not a lot of bees hopefully they're all in the first boat box filling up honey and brood <laughs> I 
как весь апостол. Full of honey. This this one's looks like there is no queen. So this is a queenless beehive. You see there is no brood. On top over there, I think there was emergency queen cells. I think what happened, this beehive already split in March. I should have checked them out in March. It was really hot, hot days. And something happened to the queen whenever they were mating. That's what sometimes happens. So you know what, to rescue these bee bees, I might join this beehive with the other beehive. You see, there's no queen, no brood. So, although this beehive survived, they split and the queen went away. This beehive might will do good, but the problem with this beehive, it's so small, I don't think it will survive at this point. It's just not big enough beehive. There's almost no bees in here. So what I will do is just join these bees together with the other beehive and just split them later. So it looks like this beehive did not make it what happens? Let's investigate a little bit. Oh, look at the spider. So, looks like super heavy beehive right here. Lots of lots of honey and everything. Look at that. Full of honey. I'm gonna harvest this. Take this for myself. And that's insane how much honey there is. This one is full too. There's not much bees left over here. Must have something happened to the queen. Look how much honey there is. I don't think I feed these bees. And there's a tiny cluster of bees died. The dead brood is not that horrible. So this one I'm going to start doing this year. I'm going to start from scratch. I'm not going to use this old comb. I feel like that's what got my bees. Such a strong bees. They might have split too many times or something. Because there's lots of honey in here. So much. All this is full. This is fresh piece of honey right here too. So I might have a couple of them. I think because I never add on second box for them, boot box, they just split to death. But that's okay. Let's see what happens to this one. This one also died. I love this tool, as you can see. It makes it much, much easier to pull frames out. Now break them apart. Okay. Wow, look at that. Full of honey. This is second boat box, just packed with honey. Wow, this is all honey. I'm gonna have to harvest this. Uh, locked the entrances, so I'll come back, get it. By the way, what's amazing about this beehive uh, boxes, I don't have to worry about mice. I don't see bees in this box at all. I don't know what happened to this beehive, because there's no bees. They just die, fly away from the hive, and die somewhere else so that way they don't infect the rest of the 
type. There is a little bit of B-side here, just one of those. And you see, I feel like because they used all these old frames, that's what got them. I might have first couple years uh, put too much of the same treatment. This year, I'm not even going to use treatments. I'm going to use a treatment free. And last year I did the same thing. Uh, there's two other beehives that did not die. So I'm just going to continue from those beehives. So this is a clean looking beehive. And then they build one of those things in here. So this is one of those beehive colony collapses. But this is why I don't steal honey from them. Because with these beehives, I don't have to worry about the mice getting in into them and I can still harvest the honey and once I have treatment BB hives like the one of these was treatment three and because I have treatment free bee hives I don't have to worry about honey having any kind of medicine or junk in there. 